We're gonna get back to some shiny fates because you know, uh, battle styles kind of beat the crap out of us. Um, so yeah, we'll get into these and welcome back, guys. Just wanted to uh, get into these little mini tins. These are by far the most profitable tins for um, resellers. And there's no problem with reselling and stuff, but you know, obviously make your best judgment based on what you're buying. Um, I purchase stuff at resale prices. So, you know, sometimes it is what it is. You can't always get everything, but I don't recommend breaking the bank to do it. Um, yeah. So I get into these. I didn't really even go over these. A Kyogre, we got the Celebi tin. These are really neat mini tins. And um, if you haven't collected these or seen the past ones, um, they are just, they just uh, create one whole image as one. And it's pretty cool when you put the uh, special cards that come inside. So we'll get to it a little bit. But um, they look pretty cool. And there's only two packs in here. But like I was saying, there's 40 tins total in a whole case. And uh, you, you sell them at $20 because $10, $10 a pack, it's $800, $800 for uh, a case of these tins. Like I said, 40, four boxes of 10, and there is 10 in each uh, box. Anyways, $800, these boxes probably cost about two to 250 range for a uh, wholesale. So quite, quite a, it's quite a big gap of growth, man. All right, so we got the pressure ram. Man, these art, the art is a rude. The artwork is amazing. The Manaphy. Dude. And we got them all here. They look pretty cool, man. Not gonna lie, not gonna lie. Look at this, man. I'm bumping my mic and stuff. Getting excited to get back into Shining Fates. You know, I'm just going to leave it like that and then we'll clip too. I don't want to keep opening every single one. Actually, you know what? Let's see. Yeah. So, um, we're going to the restaurant tin. It's got the little coins here as per usual. You know, I don't know if you can see that. <clears throat> and then you got the little code or the little card. Give you a little info. And we've got the two packs, of course. And this is actually, these are actually independent. I don't believe they are of one diagram, or maybe they are. Let's see. So then we go to the Celebi. Look at the can. Okay, same coin. No different. And then we got the Celebi. I'm not really, um... So also tins notoriously in the past were not all, um, were not the best, were not the best option to, uh, what's it called? Getting minty cards. I don't see this picture as one. This is, I think, the order it's supposed to go. But I don't even see the whole image, you know? Like, what the frick? I, always, I thought it used, to, it used to form one whole graphic like this, but all together. <laughs> okay. I thought there would be a whole image, but it's like a round image like the can. I don't know if I'm crazy but uh it ain't doing its thing but you can get some stats here you can kind of see damn bro restaurant you fucking heavy dude you're 727 pounds the rest of the pokemon are like 11 how the hell is celebi 11 pounds does that thing look 11 pounds no it is two feet though it's kind of big 
deceptively big. Celebi's deceptively big. And Manaphy, one foot. Yeah, that's my Kyogre. I mean, you big boy. You a whale, so I mean, come on now, that makes sense. The root, 150. All right, all right, cool. All right. Let's get out of this crap. Get in to the real thing. Get into those real things. I'm surprised that they don't do them like before. That's interesting. This is my first time opening the tins and I'm kind of blown away that it's like that. Um, I guess they expect you to individually frame them, which would be weird. So, I don't know. All right, so now everything is really easy to open. And um, it's just been crazy lately. I guess that's what it means. So we got Dot up the way. And like I said, we're not gonna, we're not gonna mess around, okay? Y'all don't need to see all the, y'all don't need to see all the dang doubles and triple, quadruples and five millions of the, man, come on now the same commons and uncommons. Very easy code card. Let's go right off the bat. Everybody's happy about that. Making rhymes all the time. All right. <clears throat> oh, that was some extra glue. I, what the? Yo. There's extra glue in my shit up. There be some good extra glue and sh stuff. Sorry. Yeah. Trying to do a, you know. Ooh, that one felt nice. We got something there. Felt real nice. Little, real nice little texture. So it could have been just a rare, um, rare hollow. Oh, God. Oh, dude. that felt nice. That one felt nice, too. But I don't know. Just gonna have to see. Bam. Yeah, so like I said, I'm going speed mode on this stuff. I'm not trying to play around. Um, those are all our reverse hollows, so I could be just feeling that. So, but, um, uh-oh. Toxicity. I'm I'm actually that's kind of something I'm super surprised that I have not gotten uh, Toxicity. I have not gotten any Delmise. I have like it's kind of weird. I haven't gotten a Cramorant. Some of the more common uh, cards. Oh no. Okay. Some of the more common. Uh, I didn't see what it was. I just made sure there's a energy card over there. Um, anyway, getting all sidetracked here. Jesus. Boom. Um, sorry. Train of thought out the window. Goodbye. We're going hit style, hitman style, hitmon, hitmon chan, hitmon me on karate chop. Bring your knee. All right. So you guys see those? All right. Last pack. Toxicity. So, you know, there's a few cards we haven't hit that we really do want to get in here still, but we'll have to wait and see. Ooh, man, I've never tried this way, but I kind of wanted to. Um, Cause who wants to do this? Who wants to see the same things over, and over and over and over. And over again. We've been through the set a few times. You got to see all the cards already. No need to do it again and again and again. Let's just have fun. We can talk a little bit more to you without wasting time going through them over and over. And uh, let's hope for the best. All right, so I'm gonna cross my fingers. I want the Alcremie V, 
the regular Alcrum V, the Pokey Kid, and Skyla. That is really what I want. You know, we'll take those baby shinies where we can. Those are cool, always. And um, I don't know what else. Maybe the Lapras that we, did we get, I don't think we got both. Oh, Rillaboom. I'm a Rillaboom fan and I, man, I haven't gotten a stinking Rillaboom, not even the regular B. So, oh, Eternus, we haven't got the Eternatus, uh, blah, blah, blah. we haven't got the Eternatus gold um, cards. Those are, those are another chase card I'm going for. Um, so we have, we have a pretty good stack here of, uh, of hits. So hopefully they're not all those. And um, hopefully we can do something here. Uh, this is, I don't even know. All right, here we go. Here we go. We got a Team Yell Towel reverse. Professor's Research. Okay. We got Dark Tricks. Zarude. Ooh, hey, ooh, baby shiny. Oh, it's upside down. Wow, what a cool card. Trick of this. Wow, look at that. Super cool. And we got a Galarian Weaving. Got a usual. Wow, Clobopus. Okay, we're really hitting some shiny babies now. Woo! Oh! <gasps> Guys, I finally hit it. I finally. Oh my god. Hopefully, my voice isn't too echoey, but oh my god, I finally hit it. I'm a Cinderace, um, Cinderace fan, so. This V Max, Giganta, boom! And so we got both of them now. Oh, and I'm, holy crap! What is going? On? This is why. Okay, this is why you open shiny fates. You know, it's not even a lot of packs. Ten packs, and you already got three, four hits. You know what I mean? Like really nice hits. We don't have a glare, Mr. Mind. Oh, and we finally got the Decidueye. This we actually needed. This was one of the hollows that did not get previously. Awesome. And then we got some reverse. Drop inches. Oh. And Ooh, and a reverse dark. Uh, dark tricks. Yeah, that's great. So be rare. More Peko reverse. We do have this as well. Sorry, I didn't know I was going to open up all the... Like, Oh, a Kyogre Reverse. Uh, um, sorry, Amazing Rare. Not bad. It's my second one. Um, nice, nice. Check out this one. Right non Mega. This, Tropius, and a Frost Moth, which I've had before. But look at this. Hmm. What about these eyes? This pocket. No, but look, man, that's so off. Really off. But hey, check out this. I know that was a little fast paced and in your face, but um, I don't know, that might be better because then we can talk a little bit more about other things um, throughout the videos, potentially. Oh yeah, a Cinderace. Oh man, Cinderace, baby. Not bad, this was a nice little shiny hit those shiny hit bangers um i don't have any of those so adding those to the collection is a plus and we got three of them so you know uh this is why you open shiny face like i was saying and everybody really enjoys opening the set because it gives you more hits and some sleeves a little closer look down Cinder Ace, man. I know they do. I got two of the regular V's and they finally got the V Max. Such a cool looking card. You should see the Japanese one. I actually have some promo packs coming in that have a, Jap a Japanese version. Looks sick. Mr. Mine. There he is. How to do? Decidueye. Dude, this was awesome. So we finally got the last rare. I think this is the last rare I needed. Although, um, I'm not 100 on that, but hey, I don't even 